Time once again for your Mayor's Minutes update from the City of Maple Grove. Mayor Mark Stephenson with us. Welcome once again. Thank you. First, let's talk about the local option sales tax tied to the community center. The session is... And Dean, what is the latest news you have? So with the session ending and no bonding bill being done, the $18 million that was in there for the community center didn't happen yet. Don't know if it'll happen in the future, but hopefully it will. I mean, so I think that you know, we're moving forward with the local option sales tax on the ballot in the fall. Right now we have to figure out what we're actually going to do with the expansion. There's some revisions in the plans that are going to have to happen, but uh, we'll move forward with that and see how that plays out. 2022 is an election year, as you're probably well aware. Tell us about election in Maple Grove and some changes that residents will need to watch for. Yes, yeah, so I think the one thing that's important for the residents to know is that because of the way elections are changing, and so many people are voting absentee now, we've actually reduced the number of precinct locations we've had. It's hard to staff them the way it is, and uh, so we're excited about reducing the number of precincts, but people might be surprised so they need to plan ahead and figure out where their precinct actually is. All right, maplegrovemn.gov, the website to find out more. Let's talk about a rental housing moratorium, something that was at a recent council meeting. Give us a little background. Sure, so I think that what we found is that over the pandemic time period, the amount of uh, rental licenses for what I'll call single family homes, townhomes, what we call direct entry homes, not apartment buildings, really dramatically increased. We have one inspector on our staff that has to inspect all the rental units in the city. And as we looked at it, we really figured out that we need to figure out how this is going to change our system, what's going to be done. So we're putting a moratorium in place so we can address it as a city and make sure that the rental licenses are being appropriately handled. One quick final note, Maple Grove Day is coming up in July, July 13th through 17th. Again, go to the website to find out more. Mayor, thanks again for your time. Thank you. Learn more about The Connection at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.